Hey guys, this is that bus driver guy. I want to tell you a few tips that you need to know when you're traveling in London. If you come from outside of London or you come from abroad, firstly, to travel in London, all you need is a direct debit card or a credit card. If you're coming from abroad, it may charge you some, some uh, fees, but if you want to avoid those fees, you can buy yourself an Oyster card, which you can get in the actual in the actual train station you can go in there there's a machine and you can pay for an oyster with the oyster card you can use that by touching in and out on the trains or on the buses you tap in and it takes the fare accordingly on the bus it takes 175 on the actual trains you've got to make sure you tap in and tap out i've had a quite a few visitors asking me whether they should do that on the bus you don't need to do that on a bus um, just tap in and that's it. If you use the, the Oyster card a few times in that day, it won't go past £5.75. Also, if you use it four times within an hour or even more than four times, it won't charge you no more than the £1.75 that you started off with. When you're on a bus, you normally come in through the front door and out through the back door or the middle doors. You don't come off the front door or you, or you don't come on the exit door. The trains always make sure on the trains, overground train and the underground or subway, you make sure you just tap in and out when you make sure you tap out because if you don't, it will take the maximum fare. So that's the basic what you need to know about traveling or what do you need to know to pay your fares on the bus. One more thing, on the buses, you can only use one card, pay for yourself, and whoever you're with, whether it be your partner or your children, they'll have to pay separately on, on their card, whether it be a travel card, whether it be an Oyster, whether it be a credit card. Um, the travel, other travel card I was mentioning, gonna mention, is, the, is a card type one where it doesn't use a chip, so you need to actually show the driver, it's just a normal card, it's printed the date that you're using it, and it can be used in a day, one day, or it could be a week. So they're actual the tips for you need to know to travel in on our buses and the trains. So also remember, if you don't know where you're going, ask the driver to help you. And I'm sure he or she We'd be happy to help you. Thank you. This is that bus driver guy. See you guys on the next one.